Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll discuss how to calculate number of FMCG salesmen that is required in your territory. Let's say you just got promoted to area sales manager or you are serving a stint of management training. Then you need to know how many sales officer you are being reported from. Right, so number of salesmen that are required in your territory. How do you calculate them? So we will talk about beat planning. Uh, number of like it can be weekly planning or bi-weekly beats so how you calculate those particular numbers so before that i'll just talk about this one particular territory this is gurgaon territory it is uh, divided into four divisions uh, zone one zone two zone three and zone four right so there can be various beats in this uh, one beat you can let's say it is a sector 23 sector 21 beat then there is udyog vihar beat then there is uh, DLF city, Shushant looks uh, city beat. Then there is Ashok Puri beat. There would be various 15 or 20 odd beats in this particular territory. Then how many sales officer are required in this territory for to serve all these beats? So we will be answering this question. All right. So let's assume there are thousand number of outlets in that territory. Number of outlets in every beat we take it as 40. This is our generic norm in FMCG then how many number of beats would be there thousand divided by 40 that would be 25 so number of beats that we have to cover is 25 how many sales officers would be required for this let's say there is case one as uh, that beats are all weekly first of all we need to know what is weekly weekly is when every beat is covered every week there are four weeks in a month so let's say on monday you start one beat so every Monday you will be covering that particular beat what is bi-weekly bi-weekly is you are covering that particular beat twice in a month so every alternate Mondays or every alternate Tuesdays you are covering that particular beat every 14 days all right so there are four weeks week one two three and four in that particular month every week has six working days all six working days would give six opportunities for you to cover the beat um, Monday you're covering one beat Tuesday you're covering another till sixth that would be six beats so in all if all the beats are weekly you're covering six beats all right so in that particular month you're covering six beats so that would be number of beats as six for salesman one similarly for salesman two salesman three and salesman four you're covering six beats each total would come out to be 24 beats for four salesmen still there is one more beat left because we have to cover 25 beats so number of salesmen that are required to cover 25 beats is 4 if we are considering only 24 beats so in that case maybe we can omit one beat if that beat is not that you know in terms of sales potential it is not very good or we can club that particular beat with the existing beats so we require four salesmen for that case all right so we can also take one more case where the beats are weekly as well as bi-weekly let's see how many number of salesmen would be required in that case so now we have considered that beats are weekly as well as bi-weekly so we have already taken salesmen one two and three they are covering weekly that would be six each so 18 beats are already covered now we have to cover seven more beats for that case we will take another salesman that would cover the beats as weekly as well as bi-weekly we are assuming that monday tuesday wednesday thursday and friday these five days he is covering weekly so there would be five beats on sixth uh, that is saturday he is covering bi-weekly so first sixth would be like let's say this is saturday right so this and week three saturday so uh, week one saturday and week three saturday he is covering one beat week two saturday and week four saturday He's covering another beat. So there would be seven beats. Five be uh, beats would be weekly and two beats would be bi-weekly. So total seven beats. Seven plus 18 would be 25 beats. So he is covering 25 beats. For 25 beats, uh, we need four salesmen. All right. Let's take one more example. In this example, we are taking number of outlets as 720 number of outlets in every beat would be 40 
number of beats with the same formula 720 divided by 40 would be 18 so now our target is to cover 18 beats how many sales officer would be required same if all the beats are weekly that every beat is being covered every week of the month then same concept week one two three four every week has six working days he would cover six beats every month right so every salesman one for example salesman one is covering six beats similarly salesman two and salesman three they both will be covering six beats each so total it comes out to be six plus six plus six that is 18 beats so number of salesmen required to cover 18 beats is three salesmen so we come out to uh, one generic formula number of salesmen is equal to number of beats divided by six so if you have uh, one particular number in your mind for that beats let's say you have 24 beats in your territory so 24 divided by 6 that would be 4 4 salesmen would be required to cover that particular territory this is one generic formula it is not like you have to adhere to this always but this can be set as a benchmark to uh, you know verify number of salesmen required plus uh, if number of beats is a multiple of 6 then only you should apply this particular formula for example if you have number of beats as 25 that we covered in our last example then you can understand that 25 divided by 6 won't make any sense but you can get an idea 25 divided by 6 would give you roughly 4 point something so that would be 4 number of salesmen all right so this is it about uh, number of salesmen calculation uh, thank you guys for watching this video if you like these kind of videos then please do subscribe to my channel i'll keep on uploading such videos on regular basis thank you